Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when controller is not working with like a dragon infinite wealth game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to restart the game. So if the game is on, open, close the game and then restart the game and then check. Next step is to enable or disable Steam input. Now for this, make a right click on the game, select properties and then go to the controller tab and then over here select enable Steam input. Now this has worked for many players so it might work for you. So try enabling steam input and then check if that does not work you can even try to disable steam input and then check. But for many users enabling steam input has worked but if that does not work you can try disable steam unit and then steam input and then check. Now still you are facing the problem but make sure that you restart your, the game after you make changes. Next step is to now this is for PlayStation controller user. Try using DS4 Windows or REWASD application. So you can Google these application DS4 Windows and then you can use this software. This has worked for many players so it might work for you. Now the next step is to disable Steam input. Now for this make a right click on the game, select properties and then go to the controller tab and over here select disable Steam input. Now once you disable it, now go to Steam on the top and then select settings and then go to the controller tab and then over here if you have Xbox controllers turn on enable Steam input for Xbox controller. Now if you have PlayStation controller in that case you can enable Steam input for PlayStation controller support. So make changes over here and then check. If that does not work you can always reverse the action. You can always change the settings to default. Now next step is to Avoid using Android emulator or Xbox controller emulator. Now this has also worked for many players. So if this is running in the background, if you're using, don't use it, close it and then check. Next step is to make sure you disconnect other peripherals such as mouse and keyboard. If you can, you can disable your mouse, mouse and keyboard for some time like when you after you launch the game and then check if the controller is working. If you want to connect it, later on you can connect it. Also, if you have additional joystick or controller connected, disconnect it. Unplug all the all these external devices. So if you have any external devices which you are not using, disconnect it. Also, if you have any kind of virtual controller connected, disable or uninstall them and then launch the game and then check. Still the controller is not working, launch Steam in big picture mode. So on the top right here, you can see the big picture mode icon on Steam. So click on it. Now you can click on the game and then launch the game and then check the controller. If that does not work, you can go to settings, go to properties, controller and then over here enable steam input. Now launch the game and then check. If that does not work, you can disable steam input and then check and check which one is working fine for you. Now still it's not working in that case the next step is to disable steam overlay make a right click on the game on steam and then select properties and turn off the option which says enable the steam overlay while in game turn this off launch the game and then check the controller next step is to use wired controller so if nothing is working you can use the wired connection and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the controller working with the game so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel